The world's oldest film festival has a very dark history. In 1932, the Venice Film Festival was set up by a highly problematic figure, Giuseppe Volpi. Prior to becoming president of the film festival, he had been Mussolini's minister of finance. Yes, that Mussolini. Volpi was also owner of the Hotel Excelsior, a venue with low occupancy rates, until the first ever Venice Film Festival was held in his hotel and now it's world famous. Some of the greatest stars of the hour attended, Greta Garbo, Clark Gable and Boris Karloff, the monster in the first ever film adaptation of Frankenstein. The festival lent the regime an aura of glitz and glamour, the event providing a platform for propaganda stage until the outbreak of World War II. After the war, the festival quickly dissolved ties to its political past. Barely anyone is aware that one very important award is still named after the festival's fascist founder. Last year, Kate Blanchett and Colin Farrell both won the Volpi Cup.